Hello and welcome to another Topic Tuesdays. Today's topic is on self-talk. Let's try to understand a little bit what mind chatter is. So mind chatter is all those voices we hear in our head. That doesn't mean we're crazy. We all have thoughts that are constantly in our head. Now there's different types of thoughts and one type of thought is self-talk, the way we talk to ourselves. Uh, the words we use when we uh, are encouraging ourselves, when something goes wrong, the way we uh, either hammer down on ourselves or the way we help ourselves get back up. So self-talk. Have you stopped to really think about what your self-talk is like? What words do you say to yourself? How you treat yourself with the way you're talking to yourself on a daily basis? Most of the time, our self-talk is very harsh. Um, we don't really need other people to bully us because we are our biggest bully most of the time. So if we stop to really notice how we're talking to ourselves, how mean we are being with ourselves, how encouraging and helpful we are being with ourselves, that can give us a lot of information. So we are under the misconception that the harder we are on ourselves, the more we push ourselves, the better we're going to do. However, this doesn't work for anybody. It doesn't work when we are um, having conversations or trying to encourage children or our spouse or our friends or our loved ones or our enemies. It's not going to help with ourselves either. So when we're really trying to help ourselves and encourage ourselves to do something, to uh, lift ourselves up when something goes wrong, the worst thing we can do is use that harsh self-talk to try to motivate us or to push us to do better. When we are harsh with ourselves, when we use mean words, when we put ourselves down, it's like if we're digging a hole and just sticking ourselves deeper into that hole. It's not going to help us be more resilient. It's not going to help us um, do better or feel better about ourselves. On the contrary, the meaner we are with our self-talk, the worse we're going to feel about ourselves. So pay attention to the way you are talking to yourself. Pay attention to those words that you are using and choose to be nicer to yourself. We all go through this. I mean, I've been catching myself lately. I've been trying to do a lot of this um, reflection and inner work where uh, when I notice that I'm being really mean to myself or I'm putting myself down, I choose different words. I try to be kinder to myself. I try to think about, okay, would I be telling a friend this? Would I be telling one of my children this? No. So why am I saying it to myself? So choose different words and be kind to yourself. Notice your self-talk. That is the first step in being more loving to ourselves. And we need to be more loving to ourselves first in order to share and spread that authentic love to all of those we have around us. So pay attention to your self-talk and be nice to yourself. Until next week.